Hi, this is Nathan in Neighborhood Arcade and Pinball Talk Guys. Today we're going to be reviewing Houdini by American Pinball. Please look for our review underneath the description of our YouTube video as well as like and follow us on social media formats, Arcade and Pinball Talk in the groups, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, just got on there as well as go ahead and like us below, click that subscribe button, follow us, we have a lot of content coming and it will keep going. But anyway, we appreciate you watching today and let's go ahead and get this review underway, shall we? First things first on this machine, it is a, it, it is a beautiful looking machine. I mean, God, I mean, everything from the mini TV screen in there that says bullet catch to the graphics on this, the Houdini's glowing eyes. I mean, first impressions are you walk up on it, spirit Ouija thing is glowing. I mean, it, it makes you think this machine is gonna deliver. So let's see if it does. Very nice. Nice little ball catch in the back into the treasure chest. You had a little pop-up back there that shot it into that treasure chest. So that was pretty cool. You know, now that we're looking at artwork, let's go ahead and talk about the theme of this thing. You know, obviously the, the coloration, uh, the way that the, the inserts are colored, uh, it delivers. I mean, the cabinet artwork looks good. The LED on this looks great. I mean, the designs look there. It delivers. I think the artwork there, the artwork that they've done on this is, is very nice. Coming soon to the API Theater, Haldane of the Secret Service. The theme on this, uh, Houdini, obviously uh, the master of escape. That's pretty neat, so got a little taste there. So there's a couple magnets that are in his hands from what I just noticed. So obviously his left and right hands have some magnets so the ball will get there and kind of whip around a little bit. So that's, that's a very unique kind of fun factor there. Uh, as far as the theme goes, uh, you know, it definitely, I think it's got it. The sound bites, the music in the background are definitely, are definitely kind of magic oriented to a certain extent. It's kind of like the grand, the grand act is about to happen. And that's, that's literally what it feels like. So I will say that, uh, I almost got it up there. I will say that it's uh, the art and the theme go together very well. The lock is lit again. Go for it. <laughs> Let's talk, talk about table mechanics here. Uh, right out the gate, you got a uh, magic post, kind of stop post uh, below the flippers. Uh, flipper gap is not too bad. They're actually not bad at all. You have an inlaying to the left and right. To a land line to the left and or outline to the left and right as well. You have a uh, you have a, sh uh, a shot going up into a magic area with a rollover to the left. You also have two rollovers going up to add time, which looks like it is a orbit coming around to a spinner to the right exiting out. You have a stage all or a stage alley area right there with a red uh, arrow that goes into the pop bumper area. You have a rollover which is key lane, which uh, obviously these triggers. Uh, different things on the game for the modes and so forth. Uh, you have escape, some targets to the middle, pop bumpers to the back. You have a target straight back. You get a straight shot through there, which I wasn't able to do. I was actually trying to do that. That would have been great if I could have. But it never goes as you plan. Uh, you also have uh, the stage, which is the main stage going up to the middle, which says man vanishing elephant at this point. Uh, and so obviously that opens up and you want to get your uh, ball back there. You have a pop out. Uh, pop up which is a uh, gel uh, to the right of that with a little ramp that's lit up with a green light at this point you have a rollover ramp which is almost a it's not an orbit but it's a it's a it's a lane that will take you all the way to the inside back to the the bumper area and then you also have your orbit to the right and then to the right of that you have the begin se seance which is lit up purple and then a magic target to the right of that so you know, very, very specific uh, in regards to his table mechanics. And I will say that, uh, you know, this table is a high block table. Uh, what I mean by that is, you know, I generally will look at flow too. And yes, I mean, hitting these shots to the outside rails, that's what makes this, I think this game is gonna be fun because of the difficulty. It's a moderate to lower high difficulty. And the reason I say that is because 
the flow in the front of the table is open, and then you get to the back and you have targets on the edges of each each uh, lane. And the lanes, some of them are a little narrower, and they actually narrow out more like the key lane. It gets narrower. The, the stage out gets narrower. Uh, so, you know, and then also the angle of the spinner orbit lane is actually narrow too. So those are things to keep in mind on this that it, it is going to be a more shot specific game you need to be you need to so going around that orbit right there you need to be more specific and you need to be targeted in your approach to your shot so right there just kick me out because of the lane being a little bit different there and if you notice that ball i got to the main stage so now it's going into the main stage and the uh, lcd uh, the curtains close it's opening up there's an elephant the box opens the elephant's walking into it Shoot reps three times and then the stage. And so basically it wants you to shoot that ramp right there, but I didn't get all the way up it. That is actually a little bit of a higher difficulty ramp there. It's elevated and it angles to the left. So it, it's a little bit harder to get up there. Our jail is ready for you. Uh, also, one thing to keep in mind is uh, that left uh, exit lane and end lane. Uh, the left one doesn't really have a bumper on it. The right one does. The left one doesn't. So that, that allows it to ball out a little bit uh, easier on the left side, where the right side, you have a bumper to bounce it up. So that's just something to keep in mind. Replayability on this is going to be there. I think this is a fun game. I mean, it definitely has everything you want to have for, for a pinball game. Uh, fun factors there, too. Again, ball speed, moderate. Speed level is definitely there on this, and uh, the, it, the moderate to high difficulty on this game is due to its shot setup at this point. So all in all, a great game. Beautiful, actually. Let's just be real. It's beautiful. Uh, so definitely check out our review under the description of our YouTube video, uh, as well as, again, like us, follow us, subscribe, YouTube, down below. Find us on Facebook, Arcade Pinball Talk, Instagram, Twitter. And click that red button down below. We appreciate it. Thank you again for watching today. And we look forward to our next video with you guys.